There you go. Another, uh, another mission with another ship. Let me just show you where we are. We're in the Raven now. And I've just accepted um, the mission. So this is a Raven. Uh, I've got a few skins for this for over the years. Uh, but uh, it's a standard Raven. And it's fitting is pretty, well, it is standard, it's all Tech 2. Everything on it is Tech 2. Uh, except that, that's Tech 1. So the, and the neutralizer I've just put on. Um, we're just going to do the mission, just see how we go with it. I'll show you the... I'll quickly show you the um, the mission parameters. So the mission has been done in Anishtar. It was blitzed in Anishtar. It's been done by a Raven Navy issued Sentry Dominic to the Gila. Tend to be the flavour of the month right now. So looking at your resistances, it looks like you've got pretty much... You're going to have pretty much uh, an Omni tank. So with this being uh, a sniping raven, I have given it kind of an omni attack. If you simulate that, and there you go, you've got with everything running, you have those resists. Capacitor depletes in one minute fifty. That's with everything running. That's normally that will drain the capacitor but normally you should be okay if your skills are okay uh, you can look at the range targeting range which is 287 kilometers uh, I think that's maxed out I don't think you can go any further than that and the range on the uh, standard cruise missiles just standard tech one cruise missiles are, they're 222 kilometers I think they're maxed out so yeah, without further ado, let's go and do this mission. I've already accepted it, yep, and it's in Kamoka. Okay, so we'll... Uh, I was going to put... Um, I was going to put a... Um, I can't remember what it is now. To collect all the... Oops to collect all the um, salvage but we'll see I can't, if I'm honest I can't really be bothered with that messing with salvage so if I wasn't if I wasn't streaming I'd have my, I'd have Fozzy on as well and I'd just have him in an octus following her going through room by room Warp drive active Excuse me. I think you could hear me drinking them. So let's get this on the road. Hello, Mr. Slow. I see him in the belts all the time when I'm when I'm mining with the orca. So this one is, I think you've seen this on one of my other videos, Dread Pirate Scarlet. Uh, we've literally just got to go and kill everything, to be honest. She will jump around from room to room, and then in the final room we eliminate her. But, um, yeah, so we'll just, again, we'll just kill what we can. Just kill uh, everything and move on. Drive active. She um, smack talks in local, calls me this, that, and the other. You'll see it. <laughs> so offended. Not. Okay, let's 
do this. I don't know how this is going to fare, if I'm honest. I have not used a raven for... Eight years? Maybe ten years? But I just wanted to see it and prove to people that you can do level fours in a in a cheap cheap ship that's cost what 500 million fully fitted good good to go and yeah i think it's um it's doable we'll see anyway i think i'd uh, certainly pick my missions um with this you read the mission report first you'll know what you're sort of warping into what you're going into um, that mission report is worth it's just so invaluable to somebody certainly starting starting up doing missions it can just avoid all um, all your problems if you just warp in blind not knowing what you're doing and you, I mean yeah it's fun you may lose a few ships but it's fun you know, but um, those who like to be prepared, use the mission report. Okay. Let's get to the gate. Do we get a spawn here? I'm trying to remember. Let's get everything working. That that. Yeah, I thought we did. Right, let's go back. Let's go back. I've got no shield booster on this. I'm relying purely on range. Big boys locked up. Because they're the ones I want to take out first. Right, let's jump. I'm going to keep burning back. Let's see how we do. I mean, those are at this range, they're uh, pretty much useless the projectile so this is what I was saying the other day about trying to work out how many missiles you'll need to kill a ship and then switch to the next target without, without wasting too many so there, that's your DPS there which is pretty good your damage 18 which is pretty damn good So don't forget, you've got a range on your missiles of 222 kilometers. So you can keep moving back, just not burning back, but just keep pulling away from them. If you have to use use your micro warp drive just to boost you, but uh, there, see, so I've wasted. It's only tech one hour, so it's not too bad actually. So let's go for that. Let's lock up a few more. Keep your eye on these mediums because they will obviously uh, be catching up quicker than the big ones. It does take longer to do the missions this way, guys. But for those of you just starting, who can fly a battleship, um, yeah, this is the way to get comfortable with missions and then you can, as you move forward, you'll obviously have better skills you'll have more money and you'll be able to maybe even fork out for a navy raven or um go use you know use another ship of some kind so 
I'm going to kill the uh, missiles off. And I might as well reload while I'm here. That should finish them off. There you go. That was a perfect uh, use of them. So they are burning out towards me. These are pretty fast. But they don't seem to be wanting to go that fast. So you could use faction ammo, which is expensive, of course. Uh, but I am just on standard ammo. Not expensive at all. You know, if you're looking to do um, to do your missions a cheap, a cheap way without too much cost, because I know what it's like when you first start and you've no money. This big boy's gonna pop. There you go. So we might need to leave the big ones. We'll kill this one and then we'll concentrate on the uh, mediums. So now we're at a range where we can walk to the gate. Just trying to remember if we if we can walk to the gate. Anyway, we'll see. I do love watching those missiles, the cruise missiles go. They're awesome. And they're really hitting him. And he's gone. Another one bites the dust. I'm going to reload. And we'll tackle a few of these cinnables. Let's see how quick these go down. The DPS is pretty good. On this ship, it was 858. I mean that was quick. That was pretty quick. We'll take these little buggers out. Another one gone. We'll just keep. Uh, we'll keep finishing. We'll finish off these meat. Uh, these meat. These cruisers. <laughs> Ouch! That must have hurt. Bye bye. Next. And that's another one gone. Now let's finish this big boy off. I 
Like I say, we're not wasting too many missiles. And they are standard crews. So it's not as if it's uh, huge amounts of money. I mean, these um, carriers are useless at long range like this. They just can't. They can't hit. Well, I wouldn't say useless. It, there are people out there that can fit a carrier very well and hit hard at range, but you are struggling with projectile missiles, uh, projectile weapons. And you see the damage he's got on the front. I do love those uh, effects there. And the, the more damage, the more, the more, the harder the missiles hit. More damage, and it seems to. Ooh. We may need. Oh, it happens every time. This just nearly killed him. So this lot will finish him off. Endos. And that's it, he's gone. Okay, bye bye. So let's approach the gate. Let's we'll see if we can walk to it. Cannot walk there. That's it right, the only thing we could. Disrupting the ship. So let's burn. And I'm going to use the, the um, micro jump drive, but we'll have to just sit on the gate for a bit before we warp in. So I've got it ready for the next, the next room. So it does take a bit of time. Jump. Turn that off because it's zapping my <clears throat> my cap pretty quickly. So hopefully by the time Yeah, we will have to sit on the gate for a few minutes. <clears throat> just fast forward guys if you if you're uh, if you wanna just move forward. If you don't want to sit with me on the gate. I've said before, if I was in the Tango, there'd be none of this. So I'd certainly suggest looking at, um, you know, making that path towards the Tango. Uh, you've seen my fit. If not, it's on, uh, there's a few, few videos up with the Tango. And she's so just so flexible that ship and you just walk in you just burn around work and do whatever you want to do none of this waiting for your uh, jump drive to uh, cool down and yeah it's good what's the time on that one minute 36 so we may as well just slow boat to the gate by the time we get there, we will be ready. I might as well reload while we're here. The second gate, I think that might be... Ah, right, I need to swap, uh, swap ammo to Nova. Explosive. <clears throat> Gonna burn a little bit. 
she really is slow. Cooldown's nearly done, which is pretty good. We'll get to the gate. One more blast. Let's activate the gate. Well, it'll, as soon as we get within the ring, it'll, it'll activate. Okay, so that's uh, that's done. Micro drum drive is now ready. We've just arrived on the gate. Could do with something for the cap. Might change the rig and put a capacitor control rig in to give us a bit more. Okay, we should be warping any second. Warp drive there you go. active. <clears throat> Excuse me. So uh, the second room uh, is explosive. <clears throat> so again, we've got the we've kind of got the um, Omni tank. <clears throat> so I'm not uh, overly worried, but we'll see. Okay, so I'm going to about turn. And I'm going to jump. So let's lock these up. Scarlet, she'll just bugger off, but anyway. Let's lock these uh, these ravens and kill them. Oh, it's like she's killing her own kind. <laughs> So we'll just keep moving back. So these are missiles, so every one of them will hit us. Don't know what their range is. I'm going to try and get out of their range. do need that shield booster, don't we? Especially when you, you're fighting uh, missile boats. If I, re if I remember rightly, you can get out the range of these. So let's try and do it. I mean the cooldown is nearly done I could jump again further away and then just come in at range just to give the shield a bit of a rest
Uh, so I'm going to do that. So when that's ready, it's nearly ready. I just stay here, guys. I might just stay here because there's only one missile boat left. explosive uh, ammo this time. I do love those effects, the EM explosive. Excellent. That's it. Give it another boost. I love that camo. Uh, Skin. It's like a desert skin, isn't it? And he's about to go now, and there you go. So I'm happy to stay here now. I'll put one on her, but she'll just disappear. There you go. don't know what's coming in. It's gonna hurt. <laughs> that was the first salvo straight through. to the gate now. They are slow about these ravens. Another one dead. Give us your chance to uh, recover as well. Yes, by all means, it's not the quickest way to do missions, guys. A module has run out of charges. But if you, you know, if you're not in a rush, then go for it. Let's use some cap up. <laughs> There he goes. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Love it. I must be still like the uh, the normal skin. I've got the blue one as well. What do you think to that? I quite like that one. The red's just too garish for me. It's what I would call gaudy. Do 
looking for another boost. Might as well jump. Might as well reload. What's the next room? Kinetic interval. Excellent. So we'll go back to Scourge. Been some stuff in while you're passing. Let's just drop a mobile uh, tractor beam, beam unit. Yeah, I need to do something about the cap. That's pretty, uh, pretty poor, isn't it? Which it is on the Raven, you know. The Navy Raven, of course, you're getting a better cap than this. Let's have a look at the fit for. What have I got? I've got the two. I've got these two. I might remove that and just put a. Yeah, I might just put a capacitor uh, control. Yeah, I'll improve things. Don't think I can do too much here. Um, suppose if I, if I knew the mission, if it was just a kinetic and thermal mission, I would remove this one, and I could put a shield booster on there, or even something for the cap. Yeah, it's always things to mess about with, guys. And of course, if you get close enough to the enemy, you've got this, but that's a neutralizer. You could put, um, you could put um, a, Nosfer a Nosferatu on, a Nos on. Take a bit of power off them. You know. Okay. Give it a bit, uh, a little bit of a boost. Sorry for the wait, guys, but we'll get there. What's the nature of this beast? So we're going to move straight away. We're going to move away. Because they're right behind us. We're going to go that and hit that once. Oh, 
Right, we can uh, concentrate on the big boys again. And we don't need to worry too much, we're just slowly, slowly bed away. I'm actually going to I'm actually going to try and keep in range of the gate so we don't have to do too much burning back. So we'll keep our transverse look, we'll try and keep where we are, where's that wreck? I'll orbit that wreck now. Because they are literally there. So if I orbit that wreck. Come on, big girl. So slow, so slow. <laughs> okay, Megatron is about to die. He's dead, he just doesn't know it yet. There you go. Bye bye, big boy. So these are closing, so of course you keep your eye on these. Don't forget you do have seven hammerhead twos. The range on the drones, let's have a quick look at the range on the drones. It's about six yeah, sixty uh, kilometers. Yeah. So you know once they're in at fifty-nine, send them out. One dead. Shame we don't have bigger magazines on these uh, cruise missile launchers. Hmm. So we're keeping the gate relatively close. So it won't take us ages to get to it. Go. I do like watching that. Next one. Cluster shut down. Alert. So we've got an hour from now. We'll be fine. Gonna take some of these out. They die pretty quick, so. Uh... <clears throat> I really don't like anything getting too close guys well we'll send the drones out to that one and we'll continue with that so we'll send the drones to 
Not that one. Huh. To that one, even. And this one's certainly motoring towards us. But again, it's not going to get much of a chance. So the drones have taken him out, he's dead. Put the drones on him. Kill that last battle ship. long okay the drones made light work of that one and there he goes a module has run out of charges and he's gone Bring these boys back. Oh, no. We've got another spawn. So I'll just keep doing what I'm doing. Trones can come in. Some nice, new, pristine Megathrons. They don't know what's going to get. They do now. Okay. Sweet. That was pretty good. Might orbit the gate. Yeah, I'm gonna orbit the gate. In fact, I'm gonna to go towards it. Next one. He's all on his own. There he goes. Approach the gate. Let's reload. Let's just double check the next room. That's EM and thermal. Yep, yeah, EM and thermal. So I'll uh, get the Molnir on. 
the gate. We are aligned to the gate. Let's jump. And we'll have to wait a few minutes. <laughs> yeah. We'll just let that cool down again. Literally, what? Two minutes, 42 seconds. I'm sure we can wait that long. <clears throat> yeah. So, the only thing you really need to do about with this ship is just do something about the cap. Make sure your skills are up on um, emissions, energy emissions, things like that. Um, just try and reduce the uh, usage of cap. Obviously, the main thing is this this bugger here. It's Tech 2 as well. You know. such a slow bird they really are I don't think there's anything slower than these as in battleships like I said I think the Abaddon's a pretty slow thing as well Yes, first time I've used a Raven in 10 years. So, uh, yeah. Still, I always love the Raven. I mean, Anita is, um, she is Kaldari, pure Kaldari. She can fly Galenti stuff and, and Dreadnoughts and things, but when I, when I created her, she was going to be pure Kaldari. That's why she's she's she is maxed out in everything. Missiles maxed out. That's why you've got such a silly range on the uh, cruise. It's crazy. Right, we'll go. That should have ticked down by the time we get in. Let's do it. Warp drive active. Final room, and this is where we'll kill a bitch. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do a 45 degree, go to the right, let's go to the right, and let's jump. I'm gonna, um, Give us a little bit of boost here as well. I'm going to kill these first. Keep those lights, they need to be killed. Let's go by range. Don't really need to worry about these. So I could... I could orbit this station now. Let's do that. We'll orbit the station. Keep the transversal up. These die pretty quickly. Should be enough for that one. We're 192 away now, so there's no real threat from anything. Might need to go back to that one. 
No. Excellent. Let's have a look at these. These daredevils. In fact, let's look at that one. Hmm. Love that. Love that EM effect. See, they're moving pretty quick. They'll still die. I'm going to leave the drones to the other one. Okay, so he's dead. I'm going to put the drones on that one. Start killing these. So they should make light work of him. There you go. I'll bring them back. So that's all the potential danger out of the way. Has run out of Obviously lights can scram and web and everything else. But you don't want that. Not when you're in a slow battleship like this. Slow enough. Okay, they're back in. So we'll pick away and uh, we'll pick away at the closest and just work by distance. Just work our way down. I should be fine. Uh, what's the. No, I'm going to swap out. I should be using. I should be using explosive. Let's try Nova. Should be, should be. Sorry, guys, it should be Scourge. Kinetic. Right, we're gonna move away. This is the last room as well. We don't need to uh, worry about getting to the gate. Scourge.
I'll take that off before I completely lose my cap. We've got to add it on. Always do. And he's gone. Next. <laughs> right, let's orbit again. Two seven one. So we remember we are on the missile range, we're maxing out at 222. Yeah, so let's just get these bad boys. Nice little group there trying to catch up, but they're well away. Got to hurt. Beautiful. God, I love this game. Where's Scarlet? Oh, there she is. 256. Look at her right at the back. Shivering like a quivering dog. I won't say the other. <laughs> this is a family channel. No, it's not. It's whatever. Well, they're well away. It's just obviously that sentry gun. That battery won't move. So they've moved quite way away. Okay. Now let's kill some Brutixes. This is Brutixes. I. What's the uh, collective name for Brutix? Bruti? I don't know. <laughs> These will die quickly. Oh, you didn't like that, did you? Bites the dust. And let's see where they land. Right on your nose. That's got to hurt. Has run out of charges. Ooh, we might, yep, say we might just get to kill him with that uh, last slot in the magazine. Next one. Now we'll start locking up these bad boys. And then we'll move in for the uh, kill. 
on her, the bitch. And the... We will have to move him on because it's a battery, it won't move, so... Well done, dead. So I'll start moving in. <clears throat> so here we have, those of you who will recognize that, a Dominic. Already he's damaged to hell. Look at that. All the front end just splattered. I do like those damage effects. We never had this in 2005. Sweet. Let's do another dummy. You're next. You're next. And he's gone. See you later, big boy. Okay. So it's just her and the battery and then the two uh, Megathrons. So just, just, this was really just to prove a point that you can do them quite comfortably in a Raven. <laughs> if you've got your range, you don't need that sensor booster. It's, you know, it's pretty safe if you've got the range, sniping. But this, that is a sniping setup. And I mean, I've used that, I used that years and years ago. I've no doubt you can tweak it with extras and However you want to fit it, that's that's absolutely fine. But whatever you're comfortable with, your, it's your game. You pay for the thing. Um, play it your way and enjoy. Because I do, after three or four years away, came back uh, during COVID, it was, and rejoined my alliance, had some great fun, some amazing battles. And... I really enjoyed it this time round. It, there's nothing that comes near it, guys, as far as space games. The detail in this game, the, the thinking you have to do. I love this because it's a thinking man's game. I've said it before. Oh, I'm thinking person's game. I do apologize, ladies. Um, it's a thinking person's game. And it really is, I say for for all ages, well, down to down to we've had there's been quite a few young kids playing this, but you know, it tends to be uh from about sixteen upwards, but um obviously if you're young you're not gonna be allowed into uh, corporations where there's adults and things like that. That's just a, a no no. Uh, but yeah. You can always play this on your own. You can go... I've just got another spawn. I didn't even see that. Sorry, guys. Just lock those buggers up. Shall I kill her? Let's kill her. I'm going to run out. And we just boost. Okay. Get a bit closer because I'm wasting those missiles. Yeah, but you, you play this game your way and there's so much versatility in this game. You can do faction warfare. You can do, you can do wormholes. You you could join an alliance. You can join a corp. You could 
If you just want to sit there and mine and just chillax, no problem. It's so versatile, it's so flat, it's a huge sandbox. So just get in and enjoy it. I, I love this game, always have done. It's one I will come back to time after time. I'll never let my accounts go. Right, the bitch is dead. Let's kill this. I think we might have done the mission now. Yeah, we've done the mission. But as usual, Fozzie likes to kill everything. I better move towards those. Where's her? There's nothing in hers, is there? Where's her wreck? Oh, there might be something in it this time. I didn't see her wreck go, guys. There's your bonus. It's not on us, is it? Mm. Well, I cannot see her wreck. Let's put one in the overview. I know I don't like to do this, but let's have a look. Am I blind? Right, let's kill these. Let's, re let's reload. <coughs> I mean, she was way back. Let's have a look at this building. Is that her, right? Yes. Okay. Actually, I'm going to make my way towards that because there's actually something in there this time. The last time we did this, there was nothing in a wreck. So I'm going to make my way towards the wreck. He's getting hit. They're not moving fast. Gonna die pretty quick. Let's go to the next. Ooh, I just finished him off then. Okay, let's go. your buddies boom 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 Finish these two. That's her right there, isn't it? I'm gonna burn towards it. Burn towards her wreck. Come on. I wish they'd give these a bit of a speed, a speed boost buff. Go. 
Come on. I want to see what's in her rack. A module has run out of charges. Mm-hmm. I'm going to jump right past your pal. Ah. <laughs> he's like, what the hell? And he's gone. And we're up. Oh my god, another. No, nothing. All that and nothing. Oh, blimey. Now I'm in trouble. <laughs> I thought that was it. Oh no. I'm going to walk to that. I'm going to have to walk back in because I'm going to get pounded. Silly me, that was my fault. Blame me. I thought we'd done. Now the mission's complete, so I'll tell you what guys, let's just go. Mission's done. Jobs are good and there was nothing in her wreck. Thought it might have been something decent. Ooh, look at the anomaly. My god. Not worth, not worth anything. Anyway, doing anomalies in Nullsec are awesome. Warp drive active. <laughs> okay, so we, as you can see, we have done. Um, I'm not going to go back and kill those. There's no point now. Um, certainly there's a quicker way of doing it. This is a Raven, it's a slow ship. But for those of you who are not skilled enough or not got the skills on your character to, to fly the, the bigger stuff or you haven't got the money to pay for the bigger stuff, you can still do it in this. I was doing it in this, what, 15 years ago? I was doing it in a Raven, no problem. Longer, God started this game in 2005 so that's going back a few years obviously I couldn't uh, I couldn't get her into a raven straight away but it wasn't too long and I was in Nullsec so I was doing um, I was doing the belts and I was doing anomalies in a raven in Nullsec which is great quickly um, the money quickly added up guys it really did. I mean, if you look at uh, look at the fit, all tech tech two won't be long before you could fit all this on. Uh, she's a sniper, of course. Like I said, a targeting she's maxed out at two hundred and eighty-seven kilometers, um, and the missiles will they will burn to two hundred and twenty-two kilometers. So you can keep yourself out of harm's way very easily just concentrate on your missile skills uh, you know concentrate when I got started the Anita she's just pure Caldari that's all I did just pure Caldari towards missiles I know it's different now it's changed a lot there's so many directions you can take your characters but focus on one in the early days Okay. It's uh, Instadoc. Map drive active. We've got shut down uh, soon anyway, guys. I'd like to have done some more, but so I've done the Raven. I might do some more in the Raven because there are some missions you may struggle with the Raven. Um, but I fancied doing the Gila. I might do a Macarial. 
I really fancy doing a snipe in Maelstrom. And yeah, that would be cool. I've tried to do it for Fozzy in a in a Z lot, but you just struggle too much in the Z lot. Not like the Tango. But I've tried doing it in Loki. I suppose if I get a decent fit on the Loki I could do it with Fozzy, but the Tango as you've heard me say many times is the ship for me. Just so easy to do level falls. Okay. So let's just tell her we've done it. Give me my money, bitch. Okay. There we go. Well, thanks again, guys, for watching, tuning in. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. Do appreciate it. I'll be doing more of these. Um, do you like that skin? Yeah. I quite, I'm going to keep that skin on. But yeah, thank you very much, and I'll see you. Um, I'll see you soon. Uh, the, I'm doing near enough a video a day right now while I've got time. So um, yeah, take care. Uh, stay safe when you fly. Bye bye. Thank <laughs> you.